What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Black Iowa, and welcome back to another episode of Black Iowa's Beer Review. Today, I'm going to be trying out some of that Bush Light Peach. Now, this is the latest craze, man. You've been seeing it everywhere. TikTok, uh, on the TV, every time you go to the store, they got this thing that says Bush Light Peach, and, and you know, I got to wondering what it was, because they used to have that Bush Light Apple. I never did get to try it. Now, I've heard tell that they're going to take it away, so I may never get to try it, but... I figure while this is around and the price wasn't too bad, I'll go ahead and grab it. You know, I got this, uh, it was a 12-pack for like $12.99, so not too bad, you know, for the Bush, because Bush is one of the names, you know, that's been around forever. It's, uh, you know, you want them uh, blue mountains on that can, and today we got some orange mountains on this so much, so we're going to be uh, interested to see what it's like, and to do that, we got to give it a crack, and let's have us a smell for the old nostril. Oh boy, I got to tell you buddy, it already smells pretty peachy to me. Almost like uh, like my favorite, that mango card. It kind of has that to it, so I'm a little excited to see what it do, boy. Now, let's go ahead and pour it down in this glass, do it gently down the side, like a gentleman, sir, so. And look at what's coming out of there. That is a very clear beer there, sir. And this is 4.1% alcohol by volume, which is strange. Usually I see 4.0 or 4.2. 4.1 is a new thing to me. So, got a thick, soapy head on that thing. Lots of carbonation going on. And like I said, buddy, you can see straight through the glass. It's a very clear mirror. So, let's have another smell now that it's open and breathing on us. Oh, buddy, boy, that's very peachy. So... Hope I feel peachy after having this drink. Oh boy. Oh boy. I got to tell you something, boy. That's pretty damn good right there. It's got a peach flavor to it, yes indeed. But it's not like artificial peach. It's almost like a real authentic peach deal it's got going on there. None of that like super sweet stuff. It's just got that good fruit flavor. And the mixture on there is just right because you know Bush Light, it's a lighter beer. It doesn't have a whole whole lot of flavor to it, but you're definitely getting beer flavor in there too. It's not just some, you know, box of juicy juice or something, man. That's a good fruit beer. Let me have another sip to uh, make sure that I know about it. Man, that's pretty good. Almost kind of a dark vanilla note on the back end of it, too. I don't know what that's about, but it's pretty good, you know. So, uh, as far as a food pairing would go with this, like I said, it's got that peach flavor, and if you've ever had peach, it's sweet, but it's not bitter, but it's just kind of got that thing to it. I think that's where the dark vanilla roast comes in, maybe the skin of it. So, uh, to me, with something like this, with the fruit, you gotta go spice, man. So I'm thinking spicy barbecue. Might even be able to do a little taco action on there, but just something spicy and nicey to uh, go with this fruity and juicy. So, on a scale of 1 to 10, I gotta give that bad boy a 9. Bush Light, I'm proud of you, boy. You did good. I'm excited to see if you keep coming out with these flavored products that you got. Like I say, if I see that apple, I'll try that one out. But this peach, boy, I gotta tell you, good. So, I wanna thank you all for joining me on another episode of. Black Eye was beer review. Oh, before I forget, it's a slammer, man. They, they always want to know, Black Eye, is it one you sip on or one you chug? I'm chugging it tonight. So, while I go chug it, I want to say thank you for joining me on the uh, beer review, Black Eye was beer review. Make sure to subscribe and watch all my other videos on my YouTube channel. Now, y'all have a good one. Enjoy that peach, Mr. Man. And I'll see you next time.